Thousands in Idaho and many in eastern Idaho take their message of union support to the streets. Good evening and thanks for watching tonight. I'm Todd Blackington. Thousands protested around the state tonight, including one protest in Pocatello. The city's major union groups teamed up with MoveOn.org to hold a rally in support of unions in Idaho. Phil Campbell joins us from Optimist Park with how many people were there tonight. Phil. Well, Todd, hundreds were on hand here at Optimist Park this evening with one goal, changing government at every level. A sea of union supporters filled a portion of Optimus Park as they demanded change from the government. They vowed to use their votes to keep those who are helping their cause and remove anyone that's hindering their efforts. They believe the issue is not limited to the boundaries of Idaho and they are determined to put an end to it. People are tired of getting squashed on, getting stepped on, and they're coming out, and there's, we're standing together. This is people from every branch of the labor movement. you got electricians, pipe fitters, iron workers, teachers, the firefighters, railroaders. We're all the middle class, and we're, we're trying to get squashed out by the GOP, and we're here together, and we're going to fight together. Pocatello Education Association President Bill Davis says this is just the start of things to come. He believes lawmakers may have awakened a sleeping giant and things are about to sway in their direction. This has always been a strong union state, even with uh, the advent of right to work laws 25 years ago. And I think he may be they may be stirring up uh, more than they counted on. Not everyone was pro-union at the event. In fact, a Tea Party representative could be seen walking around the perimeter, but we were unsuccessful to reach him for comment. Reporting from Optimus Park, Phil Campbell, KPVI News 6.